a uh, Vex robot. It looks like a successful one.
For, uh, this is for Trinity Firebot. We decided to build a walking robot because I don't know say this. Anyway, so we, we cut all the parts out. All, it's made mostly out of aluminum. We cut it all out on a uh, water jet. So we put uh, a hand designed it in CAD and uh, SolidWorks and we converted it. It's heavy. So uh, we cut out, we designed it in SolidWorks, converted it, cut it out in a, a water jet, put it together. We're using a color chip. It's an 8-core microprocessor, which has some serious pluses and minuses. It's being rather difficult to program, and we've burned out two boards in the past two weeks. And that happened this morning, though. We didn't even got here today, so... It's not quite up to par, but it's going to walk around and should hopefully shoot its carbon dioxide. We got to do the Trinity Firebot. There's the Versa Valve Challenge. So you sign up for it, and they send you a free solenoid valve, which is mounted right there. We then got the, the commercial like bike tire blower thing. I don't really know. It holds it holds a CO2 canister. We got some fittings attached together. There's a, a rubber tube that runs down along the bottom, and we'll, it ends <coughs> right there. Eventually, we'll put a there'll be a photo cell on top, and so it'll just pan back and forth, looking for the candle once we get to it, and hopefully extinguish it. So, what's it supposed to do? Right now? <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yeah, usually, kind of, usually has some issues. And so the next robot uh, with the trailer. Uh, looks like a mechanized ramp of some sort. Excellent job, guys. These guys never go home, by the way. They stay in a level. <laughs>